back to some BTS um, live. Everything, everything's fine. Everything's good. I'm in a really good spot. I don't feel bad or anything. Probably sounds like, I just want to, you know, the other couple days I was in a funk. I'm not in a funk anymore. But what is kind of crazy is I, there's so much stuff that I want to listen to that I feel like I need to make 20 videos a day. I don't even know. Like, I want to watch this whole concert. But then I also want to watch all the other stuff that I haven't gotten around to. Which is classic K-pop. This, I guess my hand pushing over here means classic. I don't know. All types of stuff. You know, old girls' generation. And, and then I want to hear all the stuff from Twice and Red Velvet. And I know a lot of you guys are like, Dude, it's a BTS video. Why are you mentioning other people? Because I... I love music. I love music. It's, I, there's no, I, there's no other way to, whatever. I'm not saying anything interesting or compelling. That's okay. I don't have to be one of those guys who goes, hey guys, I'm here to hear K-pop and I love everything that I hear and I'm going to make sure I have this little somewhat fakeish smile on every, that's not me. But you already know that. Let's go. I already love the bass playing. He's using dynamics and his touch is great. Uh, touch being the timbre, the texture of his tones, and dynamics being him actually using some loud and soft in the um, bass playing, giving it more of a vocal quality. For you guys, uh, I've heard this song, the album version, for the first time in the last couple of weeks because I wanted to hear the album version before watching the live one, but I've only heard the album version once. I did like it. It's probably out of the, the first three songs they've done. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Alright, I just gotta talk about sugar for a second. Um, one, I love the disposition between his like kind of chilled out non-stage persona and then when he's rapping, but where he was just rapping, there was not percussion and his just being on time. That has to be internal when you just have swelling stuff and no drums or bass to carry you. He just knows where the beat is. I'm 
Okay, all right, all right. I remember J-Hope's verse, and I like it even better live. And the weird relationship that I'm having with the rappers is there's... You know, it's weird to, like, compare them on the fly. But I, I think Suga might have the most power. And I think RM is the one that I feel like we all need to be like, in a sense that there's a complexity and deepness to what he does. But I just feel a bonding with J-Hope. Like if I could only hang out with one, we're just gonna hang out for the night. I will hang out with J-Hope. <laughs> Great harmonies. He's just so commanding. Ugh. I think RM has the, of the three rappers, he's got the best vocal texture and the ability to lay back. That guitar line. Just the burst of straight fire. Yeah. save it right um hey what's up cat cat just opened the door to walk in that's what she does she actually opens the door sneaks in and comes and jumps up usually she'll walk across the room which is she's doing right now making sure that everything's cool and then she's gonna circle back around come back to the chair and then jump up I'll give her like 10 seconds where is she going now she's under the chair now she's touching the chair. 
And she's up. Find out my chick or what? What's up, Choo Choo the K-pop cat? Meow meow. Uh, I can't top that. I cannot top the cat walking in the room and me telling you exactly where she's going to go and what she's going to do and then she does it. We just have a bond like that. I rescued her from the wild. She was living by a river when she's a couple weeks old. And uh, I took her home from two, 230 miles away. I was like, you're coming home with me. You don't need to live out here in the wild. So I think because of that, we just got like a little thing going. Where she's pushy. She's pushy, but she knows she can get away with it. She's kind of like a dog cat. Anyhow, we're going to go into... Ooh, I haven't done some Blackpink in a while. We're going to do a Blackpink live song. See you later. Speaking of... Tell me about your...